This is Mario with MIA Microflight once again and in this video you're viewing the MIA Poly Trica Sail or Land Yacht also called Land Sailors. This is a PVC tubing frame. It's a very simple T. The axle is PVC. It's got a couple T's. One to join the axle with the base, another one to hold the mast, and it's got a 45 degree for the front wheel steering column. The steering at the front has been done with a 3D printed uh, part, as are the wheels, as well as these long arms here that uh, have been mounted to a, a dual servo control. This is uh, unique in the sense that I'm employing two servos here for a higher torque and pull on the sail. Typically you use a winch servo for these uh, types of uh, air, uh, RC models and I have a winch servo so I decided to do a dual standard servo configuration here and it pulls it quite nicely. Uh, you can also do it with one but it uh, takes a little effort on the, on the servo to, uh, to pull this uh, so you can get the acceleration when the wind starts building up on the sail. This is a um, sort of a loose connection here, meaning that when I pull on this, you can see how that moves. And that is because the throttle servo has been coupled or mixed to the rudder. You could put these two in Y connection with a servo reverser um, um, uh, electronic uh, uh, control in case the servo wants to go the other way. The idea is to have both of these servos go at the same rate at the same time so that it pulls on the mast uh, cable, control cable. The um, battery here is uh, a standard three cell a light pole. I think this is a 2000 uh, milliamp hour a receiver and all the connections to the receiver. These uh, blocks that you see here are also for um, this is a, a block for a plate. These couple blocks hold a plate here that are going to be a support for the battery and the receiver. I have to do that plate. It can simply be done out of uh, uh, also PVC. Um, plate or plywood even um, it can also be done out of aluminum I mean there's a number of ways to do this but that's what those blocks are there for and they're supporting my battery right now kind of a little bit rough this is a uh, servo mount a block one for each side that allows me to relocate this if I need to or slide it on the PVC tubing so is this block actually I started with this block here you can see that dual mount one on top of the other one uh, for a one servo control of the uh, sail and another servo for the steering bottom one is the steering but I wasn't getting enough uh, torque out of the one servo configuration so I decided to design these uh, other blocks to hold these two other servos as you see them here and so that's how that operates. Now the control for the steering via this cable is also adjustable via this uh, uh, tab here. You can slide this tab and make it uh, uh, tighter or longer on the angle at which this uh, pivots. <clears throat> the sail is uh, Mylar sail which has been reinforced with uh, Dacron um, edging. The uh, cord is a, it's a poly cord. I'm using these P clips as I consistently uh, use these in all of my products, in my microflight products. Uh, 3D printed part here, these little tabs that allow you to adjust the uh, tension on the cables here. There's another one right there. There's another one here. And that connection has been done with a, this is just an aluminum uh, 
um, uh, tubing that has been compressed here to hold this hook in place. I can always unhook this if I want to remove the sail from the body. There's, an, there's another hook there and there's another hook at the other side. These wheels are 3D printed. I believe these are 5 inch diameter for the wheel and the um, tires are actually foam. It's all custom done. There's no you can't buy these things on, online. You can buy similar size wheels, but not like these. Uh, these uh, take a, a one uh, ball bearing per wheel instead of two. I do have some other ones that take two ball bearings, like a uh, skateboard um, uh, wheel, but it's just a little too much. One bearing allows it to spin a little smoother and faster. So basically, this is the uh, MIA. Poly Trica sail or PVC lanyard without the body. Now I did work on the body. I made a, a cardboard mock-up of the body, very similar to the original MIA Trica sail, the, or, the yellow one that you see in a previous video I just uploaded uh, uh, today. So that a similar body will be going here, and um, because this is a bit wide. It extends uh, beyond the, the body width. I will have to cut a couple side holes on the body to allow these things to come out. Um, so that'll clear that up. Basically, once again, that's the control, the directional. Hardware is uh, standard uh, American hardware. Uh, there's nothing metric here as far as the hardware. Uh, the only thing metric here is I think these uh, these screws here that uh, for the servos, and this screw here that holds the um, uh, w this wire link in place on this adjustable uh, arm. Once again, this is Mario with MIA Microflight. Stay tuned for more.